There's a lot of oil trapped in the subterranean rock of the Permian Basin, but to get it out of the ground, you need water. And in the dry and remote lands of the China Draw Valley in West Texas, water is not easy to come by. Water is a precious resource. If you notice behind me, it's a more of a desert climate. We tend to be in a drought a lot of times, so water availability is very low. We can't drill wells, we cannot uh, complete wells without water. The completion design has changed and now it's increased to where we use about 550,000 barrels of water per well. And so with that increase in water demand, uh, that's when we had to start looking creatively at how can we supply that water in a more environmentally prudent manner. Karen and her team work on a project designed to do just that. It's a system by which produced water, the water that comes out of a well as a byproduct of producing oil and gas, is captured, cleaned, and stored for use in the hydraulic fracturing of future wells. We need water, but how can we do that in the most environmentally responsible way? We always have the option to use fresh water, but our goal is environmentally to use recycled water because one, we have availability of produced water. And two, we're setting ourselves up to be able to recycle and hold that water and reuse it. Here's how it works. Produced water goes from a well to a central facility and then moves by pipeline into above ground storage tanks, at which point the water goes through a series of treatments to remove solids, iron, bacteria, and other contaminants. The cleaned water goes by pipe into the large water pits and then by lay flat pipe down hole to stimulate another well. This new system of recycling and managing water makes economic sense and more importantly, conserves fresh water for humans and animals. For me, this project is about not wasting. We want to conserve water. We also don't want to spill it on the ground because one, it's wasteful, it costs money. And two, if it's treated water, we want to make sure that we're not hurting the environment. In addition to its economic and environmental advantages, this new way of managing water also makes communities safer by getting thousands of trucks off the road. Trucks that were previously the only way to get sufficient quantities of water to drill sites. These pits together hold 1.5 million barrels of water, and so it hasn't been easy filling them up for their first use. The first wells completed with help from this project earlier this year were able to use a blend of 32% treated water and 68% water from local sources. Karen's team's goal is to use 100% recycled treated water for well stimulation in China Draw by 2020, and to start implementing the program in the Zia Hills area at the same time. How can this not be exciting? You know, that we're doing groundbreaking uh, technology with recycling water and using it to stimulate wells. We all do this for our families, right? Being able to say that when I leave here someday, I can pass this off to somebody else to take, it's a very positive thing. If we can't pass on this world to those that are coming behind us, then again, we shouldn't be operating.